What's up, Facebook? Autumn here. I'm actually coming to you guys live from the set of Fixate. And I have some really fun big news. If you saw my social media post on Saturday, I let you guys know that after a little bit of... Uh, actually a long, a long two-year debate, three-year debate, on what unsweetened almond milk should be counted as. It used to be counted as a yellow. It has been changed, and it is going to be counted as a teaspoon. So eight ounces of unsweetened almond milk is now counted as a teaspoon. It's much more accurate in terms of its calories, the fact that it doesn't really have carbohydrates, that sort of thing. Um, I've been asked a lot why it was counted for yellow for so long, and here's a great thing. We're always growing, we're always improving, we can always make changes, and that's fantastic, and you guys heard me talk several times about the fact that I didn't really agree with the fact that it got categorized into a yellow, but I am not the nutritionist on staff, and we had a nutritionist on staff who felt that since it is a processed milk that we didn't want people to um, to drink it all the time and so that's how it ended up in the yellow container because that's sort of our treats and our cheats and that sort of thing but I wanted it to be much more accurate for all of you guys so we have now done what we call Shakeology bases meaning all of our different milk beverages that you might put in your Shakeology and we've containerized them a little bit um, what I consider more accurately. So I'm telling you guys what they are right now. So first and foremost, the unsweetened almond milk, eight ounces of it is one teaspoon. I've got my little cheat sheet here. Then we have low fat milk. Eight ounces of low fat milk is gonna be one yellow and half of a teaspoon. Again, calories that's in there, protein, carbohydrates that's in there, that's why it gets categorized that way. So it's a much more accurate category to fall into. So that was um, that was low fat milk, one to two percent. Unsweetened soy milk, eight ounces, is now going to count as half of a red. Unsweetened coconut milk, eight ounces, is one teaspoon. Unsweetened rice milk, eight ounces, is going to count as one yellow. And unsweetened coconut water, eight ounces of that, is going to be half of a yellow. So those are all your milk beverages right there that could potentially go into your Shakeology and that sort of thing. And those are the new containers. Things will start to get updated in recipes and that sort of thing. But bear with us because obviously uh, we've been putting out recipes for a long time on the blog and the show and that sort of thing. And uh, so we will be updating that kind of stuff. But there it is. And really quickly, let me just give you, since I've got you guys, we also did um, a little update on our beverages for alcohol. So obviously you guys know wine is a yellow. So five ounces of wine is one yellow. A 12 ounce light beer is one yellow. A 12 ounce regular beer is one and a half yellows. And 1.5 ounces of hard alcohol is one yellow. So there's your measurements for your alcoholic beverages as well. I hope you guys continue to enjoy it, especially um, your Shakeology now with your different milks in there and everything. Um, you have a really accurate container count so you can keep even better track. All right, I am gonna get back to set, get touched up and get ready to make some delicious food. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.